Hello, and welcome to River Island. Um, we're changing it up a little bit this time, and what we're going to do is, if we're visiting different communities, there's a lot of new home developments that are available that are out here, decent price points, like these particular ones, they start in low fours, and in a few minutes we're going to go ahead and do an interview and get more information, but we want to let you know there are so many different options. We're at the River Islands community, and Lindsay here is going to tell us a little bit about the different communities that are available. Hello. All right. So up on the wall presently, we have four of the five neighborhoods, the brand new neighborhoods we're selling in. Uh, starting prices, depending on the square footage of the home and the lot. We have different uh, different homes out here as far as single story, two story, lakefront, small lot, large lot. Really a huge array. So we probably have what you're looking for. Um, lowest price point you'll we'll see at the moment is 360 Lakeside by Kuiper Homes. They're four to 5,000 square foot lots and their starting prices are in the low fours. Okay. Uh, Crystal Cove by Tim Lowe's Communities, as well as Tidewater by the new home company, they start in the mid 400 thousands. These first three neighborhoods right here, they all have lakefront property available. Oh, okay. So there's a premium with those, and it's different because there's smaller, smaller lake, very large lake, and then a shared lake. Okay. And then our largest product at the moment, uh, Summer House by Vandale Homes. 3,000 to 4,000 square feet, they're monsters, but they're beautiful. Oh, wow. They start in the low 500s. Okay, that's really good price point. And what, tell us a little bit about the community. What should someone expect when they come here? What is this community like? Absolutely, so River Islands is a master plan community, mm -hmm. which means there's all kinds of parks and lakes and schools and everything around all of the houses. So when people come out here and they're purchasing a home, they're also buying into the community as well. So River Islands is 5,000 acres, and we're at the end of the project, there's gonna be about 11,000 homes. Oh my so gosh. people come in here and they're curious, is this all you have right now? <laughs> yeah, we still have 10,000 homes to go. Wow. So we'll be out here for a little bit, probably wow. about another 20-ish years. Oh I know, it's kind of crazy. Um, there's also going to be a town center, okay. which is like a downtown area. So that's where we'll see restaurants and retail, apartments, condos, a grocery store, and a gas station. Oh, okay. There's a couple lakes up in the town center all ready to go. Okay. So that's probably where we'll see some of the restaurant dining on the water. And so right now we have the boathouse. Correct. Yes, the boathouse is our first facility. Okay. It's our first restaurant. It's open every day from 11 to 10. And it's also a facility you can rent the entire place out. They have a 5,000 square foot deck. Plenty of people use that for weddings or just parties. Right. It's a fantastic place. Wow, sounds exciting. So, you know, come on down. If there's a lot of homes that are available. And it's, this is a great little secret, I would say, because a lot of people don't really know about the um, River Islands community. But if you're looking in this particular price point, which is like low fours, yeah, low fours <clears throat> all the way up to the low five starting. Okay. So if you're in that price point and you're, you're tired of, you know, in the Bay Area having to bid and you want to just move right on in, come on down. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs>